Hi guys, I'm Nagadachan, and welcome to my reaction for Fairy Tale episode 314. So we learned about Iran's and a little bit about Erza. And I must say, Iran's story backstory is so goddamn tragic, sad, but also messed up, and like all the other things. Yeah, so much happened, right? Oh my god, I feel like nobody in this freaking show has a happy life. <laughs> right? Everyone has struggles, everyone lost someone. But like, given the connections and the theme of this anime and the fact that like, nice guilds like fairytale guilds are kind of like, taking little kids in, orphans, it's kind of bone bound to be kind of true. Yeah, hmm. Even without people dying left and right, it's like a lot of mess up stuff happening. <laughs> yeah, so that's like very sad. And Iran and Erza are going to fight because Iran's enemy, right? So I wonder how that will proceed. Plus we have the problematic Watnatsu, he's kinda lost in his mind. And I kind of don't like it because I don't know if friggin' E&D would fully awaken, he would go right after Zaref, try to kill him, probably kill him, and then he would probably die? I guess... I assuming it might be because he would fulfill his... like, what he was made for. But... I don't know, like, if he would die even if Zara would be killed by someone else. Though, specifically, Natsu has, like, role him to kill Zara. So, I, I don't know how, like, <laughs> what they can do with it. <laughs> right? Like, trying to do something with Zara, like, kill him or, I don't know, stab him. But, like, if Natsu would die even if someone else kill him we we are in trouble yeah we're in a big trouble god damn it oh my well yeah i guess i'm going to start because i'm just intrigued so starting it right now okay a little closer okay we're back to irene iran irene okay irene Biological. Also, no one I'm thinking about that. Ersa was in her body when she was transforming, transformed into dragon. Wouldn't that do something to her? Like, she might not be half dragon or something like that, but like, you know, some kind of weird properties. Yeah, that's, that's fucked up. Because Elsa was in her body while she turned into dragon. So like some of that power might have seeped into her? So I wonder if that might be the case. Oh, this is very... Yeah, that armor previously, very intriguing, which looks like rabbit, because the ears or whatever it is. That looks actually very sci-fi-ish, and I like it. Something which would fit in Eden Zero, actually. Now, when I'm thinking about that, it would definitely fit in Eden Zero. That rabbit outfit armor. Oh, that was too much. Too much? Here. Oh, two little babies, drag meals. Oh, Wendy's full on there. Don't lose your cool. Ouch. Ouchie. Well, thank you for bragging about it. Really, you feel nothing. Yeah, this armor is pretty cool. Yeah, she probably not push over. We already saw some. 
Oh, Wendy Helpin. Oh, damn. It's a tag team biatch. I might not be able to do it alone, but like, I have a friend here. Master Enchant. How come? Oh, no. How dare we? Yeah, I feel you, Wendy. She looks so badass. Also, who is probably trying to hurt her even more and is our enemy? Okay. Well, yeah. That's why. Exactly. That's why they did this, because they knew what would happen. We now get the full picture. That's exactly why they did that. Everyone. It's supposed to be for everyone. Which is so nice. Like, it makes even more, like, impact knowing this. Because, like, we got the whole picture. We now know what it exactly means. Like, when I heard turning them into dragons, I didn't thought it would be such a big problem. But, well, it was a big problem. Well. Maybe talking to him would help him. Even if he's not awake. He is aware of his surroundings. Depends how deep in sleep he is. But like, yeah, that's how your dreams happen. Okay. Yeah, we heard. Aww. I missed seeing him. He's so cool. So goddamn cool. Oh, but... Mm, and it's interfering with that? Yeah. Oh no, that doesn't sound good. Or, or I mean, would probably look cool, but... Um, 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 yeah, this is dangerous. Yeah, we cannot have that. We absolutely can't. Yeah, like these two merging... He might look cool, but... Yeah. Yeah, so yeah, she took his name. She really deeply cared about him. She didn't know it's possible. Yeah, I thought she would be pissed, a little bit jealous. It's not fair. She's just a desperate woman. She did uh, probably some lot of shitty things, but I kinda understand. Yeah, these children, they just don't need to suffer from this because their dragons help them. Okay, this is such a cool tag team! Wendy! Okay, but she's very powerful. I mean, we know that Wendy is a kind of like caster type of magic has she has. Oh these swords sword badass. Did she just eat that?
I don't like this. Oh yeah, she got the idea. Of course she would try that. She's super jealous. No, can we save Wendy from that? This is not good. No! No, can, can we purge her from it? No. Okay, this Wendy is a little scary. <laughs> no! Shoo, go away! Shoo! Go away! No young cute bodies for you, woman! I guess, yeah, it makes sense it was probably compat compatibility problem. Just that? Somewhere in... Oh no, I don't believe it. Her spirit is more stronger than that. There is probably not many things what you can do again. We don't care! I'm sure Wendy must be somewhere inside, still there. She wouldn't just disappear like that. She's a strong girl and she's a dragon slayer. I mean, different body, different... Things. No, we don't agree with Wendy like this. Wendy, wake up, wake up. Bitch slap this bitch out of yourself, which sounds weird, but... No! Can we do something about that? Wendy! Wake up! Poor Erza! Poor Erza! Yeah, talk to her! That's my... kind of... No, it's not. She's stronger than that. She's way stronger than that. Shut up. She's way stronger than that. I do not believe such bullshittery. Come on, speak to her. Me neither. This sword is such a badass sword. And this armor. Yeah, that's tiny little problem there. That... Wendy. Oh, the moment. I don't know, Boinkner on her head. <laughs> Maybe that would do something, just boink her on her head. <laughs> Yeah, they had some really cool moments. <gasps> Come on, Erza! Do not listen to her! If you cannot slay her, just... I don't know. <laughs> what the... Oh, that's not fun at all. And it's also really cool armor. Irene! Wendy! Wendy, wake up from that. Mm. Oh, she's in her body? Probably works, yeah. She just saw her doing shit, so... Took her a little while, yeah. That's so weird. <laughs> Wendy is Iran. Iran is Wendy. And uh, Iran's body is probably... <laughs> this is not the time! I mean... 
she was watching you. I mean, she entered your body, which... I, I guess... Has better usage with the magic. When it is not as experienced. Like, I guess her body... Uh, yeah. Yeah, magic power, that's what I meant. Of course. <laughs> then he's like, I like it, but like, my body is my body. Seriously, she's trying to hurt her. I don't think she cares. She is so crazy. Iran really wants to be human. She doesn't care. You think you can hurt me and I won't go there? It's me, Wendy. I don't give a freak. <laughs> Wendy. What a badass. I like, yeah, magical power. Irans is bigger than Wendy's. Damn. Yeah, but she is very hurt right now. And she never did anything like that, and it probably took a lot of her. Probably. But what else? Wendy is the best Wendy. Yeah, just slay the bitch. After what she did, I'm really mad, so... Okay. I approve. And is I super serious. Well, you shouldn't pick a fire with us, lady. <laughs> Aww. Your end is so pretty, though. Like, really. Well, this is really a cool spell. But like I've said many times, Fairytale is doing things for a good conviction. What is your conviction, lady? You're doing this only for yourself. Maybe a little bit for Zarev, but like, uh, more for yourself. And you don't have such a connection with Zarev like these people have connections with themselves. Not even with your daughter. I'm sorry I don't want to give you my friend's body. We can understand it pretty sure, pretty well. Hmm. And she, she has been through a lot of shit also. But everyone here suffered from different things. Yeah. Exactly. You have no one. Are you trying to hurt her? Seriously. She went crazy. Oh, she's turning into dragon again. Yeah, that might not have been good. She looks badass as a dragon. I really love her form. She's very beautiful still. <laughs> but like, that's bad. I guess she got so mad and desperate that she turned back. She had something else 
to hear about it and see it in front of you and it's big. Yeah, this is not going to be very easy. We need some Dragon Slayer. We need some Dragon Slam magic. Wendy is out. Yeah, I mean, it's a freaking huge thing with a lot of forums behind it. Seriously, you. Come on, Elsa. Oh, shut up. Elsa, you've been through a lot of torture already, so... You can still go through this, probably, maybe. Seriously. Okay, I mean, we know you are crazy powerful. We don't need to brag about it. <laughs> yeah, I mean, when Buddy says no, Buddy says no. No! No, can we do some? Um, is that a freaking meteor? Um, well, this is turning into Final Fantasy VII a little. Okay. Can we do something about this? Yeah. A lot of people probably too, because this is a small area and that meter is very huge and the blast will be very huge. Duh. Seriously, this woman. Jesus, she's so petty. Yeah, try something. I don't know. Oh, I mean, I can move at least one arm. All her strength. I mean, what is she supposed to do? Lay down and die? Of course not. I mean, we don't know. Has someone tried it? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, that also seems like that kind of a person. I'm queen too, bitch. <laughs> oh. Just don't die. Oh, I mean, it's her duty. Crazy person, we love, yeah. <laughs> okay. I'm going to skip this. Okay. Yeah, okay, wow, duh, duh, duh. those things happened. So, the fight was really cool, not gonna lie. Yeah, especially Wendy. Oh my god. Oh, tag team between Wendy and Urza. Amazing. Ah, oh, Wendy. Wendy comes such a lot. She came such a long way. I can't even, right? Yeah, I'm glad that she was able to kind of do the spell. The same one Iran was. Irene was. I mean, she was watching her, seeing what she is doing. So, yeah, maybe she learned from that, or maybe she had some kind of idea how it works. That was really cool. Yeah. So then she fought her from Irene's body, which has more magical power, so it was kind of easier <laughs> to break Irene in her body, right? Yep. Also, Irene is a freaking dragon, so... Yeah, that, that probably helps. Even if she looks like a human, that probably helps a lot. But then she got super desperate and turned into actual a dragon. Yeah. 
and call the freaking meter for help. Jesus Christ, woman. Jesus Christ, she was like, really, yeah, I'm very pissed at you that you dare to oppose me, so I'm going to draw a freaking meter on you so everyone will die. Whoa, <laughs> chill. But like, yeah, I, I do really feel sorry for her. I do, because she's been through a lot. And she just hates herself, what she become. Like, she become a dragon. She hates it. And then she hears about these, like, little kids, which... Also are also dragon slayers, but their dragons protected them Right, so they would not turn into dragons at all They kind of stop that process completely because how long they were inside of them And kind of I guess their magic was helping to I guess like the seeds they've been talking about kind of put them into sleep forever Yeah that is very sad. Extremely sad. Oh moly. But Erza showed her that she is truly an um, amazing person. <laughs> I mean, even at the end, Irene was like, What the frick is this person? She's my daughter? What the fuck? Yeah, kind of impressed emotions. So good. Very good. But like, yeah, Erza... Of course she's going to protect people she cares about and it's I mean yeah it's her duty but like she's not doing it out of a duty she's doing it because she cares about these people but like you you understand right what I mean by that <laughs> she's not going to like let any anyone die all the strength into whatever she is going to do <laughs> against a freaking meter what is it with the freaking shannons and people villains just blasting meters down? Madara did it. Right. Freaking in One Piece it happened too. Now in Fairy Tale it happened. Have it ever happened in Bleach? Don't really remember. Don't really remember. But Fairy Tale is the other one, I guess. Seriously, what is it with shonens and meteors? <laughs> right? Like, what is it with that? Yeah, that was really cool. So I'm going to give this episode 8 out of 10. I just love the tag team of Wendy and Urza and like, this, the fact that I'm still sad about Irene despite I don't really like what she's doing, but like, I, I understand her feelings and what she's been through. And... A lot of bad as an epic shit been happening this episode. So yeah, I really like it. And I guess that's all. Goodbye and see you next time.